Good morning, ladies and gentlemen. Uh, it is a beautiful Tuesday morning here in uh, Austin, Texas. Uh, this is day 1078 of the Three Plus Minutes of Blank Challenge. And as always, I am filled with gratitude. Uh, thoughts in my mind. Uh, first and foremost, uh, happy Independence Day, Nigeria. Um, it's pretty amazing to be able to uh, celebrate it in this moment, especially for so long that secretly I was embarrassed to be Nigerian for a long time. And uh, what I ultimately realized is that then I, that means I'm embarrassed about me in some weird way. And so to be able to celebrate it in this moment is uh, really cool. Um, secondly, um, I wanna talk about what the Holy Spirit brought to me last week. Um, it told me to tell someone that I loved them, even if they didn't love me. And uh, it was a big thing for me. Actually, I avoided it for a while because my ego wouldn't uh, wouldn't accept it. Um, how do you tell someone you love them and they don't even love you and even don't want to hear that you love them? Um, but it kept sticking on me. And so this weekend, I told that special someone that. And what I realized was it, it's not about what they say to me. It's not about what they think. It's about what I'm feeling. And here's the honest truth. I did love them. I do love them. And uh, it spoke to the idea of unconditional love. Un 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 unconditional love doesn't mean that someone's gonna love you back or gonna return the feelings or reciprocate them. It just means if you have a feeling about someone and you really truly mean it, then be it. My love is never based on what you do to me, how you treat me, how you feel about me. If I love you, I ultimately and truly do love you. Uh, last but not least, uh, I wanna celebrate these two gentlemen. Uh, they just recently passed. One is the Kimbe Mutumbo, <laughs> the finger wag, and the other is Pete Rose. Uh, I just recently found out that both gentlemen passed yesterday and they both were influential at some point in my life watching their journeys and they didn't have perfect journeys um, most specifically with Pete Rose people may never forgive him for what he did but it's always a reminder that we're always human and we're going to always make mistakes no matter how perfect we try to be and it's in how we redeem ourselves that's really most important. And so, Pete Rose, I'll always think of you as a Hall of Famer. And to Kimbe, <laughs> thank you for showing me an African man can do amazing things in this world during your playing career and even beyond it. Rest in peace, gentlemen. That's my thoughts for the day. And as always, be blessed today and every day. Thank you for listening. Happy Independence Day, Nigeria. Peace.